Risa Greenfield claims she doesn't take special interest money. Yo, what up, what up, what up? Caught me one of them sub speakers again. Motherfucker got subs in it. Hundred and like seventy dollar speaker. Had to go cop one of those again. Cause I lost my other one. Give me that, give me that, give me that. I want it all you go, give me that. What y'all up here doing? Yo, what up, G? Is your name Garo? I don't know how to say that, bro. I ain't gonna lie to you. I'm kinda high as hell right now. Uber Pimp was locked away, and now I'm coming out them chains. You got, or you gonna be. But how y'all night going? <clears throat> you feel me? It's like where I'm at, it's like 1.35 a.m. Hell yeah, bro. Who can you trust? Who can you trust in a world full of lust? And Deborah and make it for Deborah. Man. This album finna drop soon. It's almost out. We just dropping all the songs. From now on, we just gonna drop all them songs. So, hey, every time we drop a song, y'all go tune into it. Shout out to Damon. Shout out to France. Y'all got any questions, ask them. I'm communicating with the fans. I want to know y'all opinions and shit. You know. What y'all think about the song so far? How y'all think of, what y'all think about the album so far? All these niggas act tough like a king until I come and check them. Them niggas done turn to some pond. Smoking these niggas, you know I stay high. The rest I will appear. Out of the season, but still hunt you like deer. Devil's controlling, I cannot see clear. And I walk up to you and I say, give it here. If we don't give a fuck, we would do the jump time If you fuck it with us, have your whole family crying Don't be posting your face saying, please help us find Nigga, I'm staying, you might just be net Credit cards, money, gram, even the check Bullets, eject, leaving shells on the deck And we dragging your body and you're it in sex Creep on behind you, put crump in your head And I don't give a fuck, bitch, I just want it all Put in your head and I don't give a fuck, bitch. I just want it all. Give me that, give me that, give me that. I want it all. You gonna give me? I pearl this motherfucker. I've been smoking this bitch for. I was smoking this bitch before I went live. I've been smoking this bitch like 20 minutes. 
this bitch burning so slow. I wonder at all you will give me that. Hold up, my pops text me. Hold up one sec. Shit. But let me see who said that. Tavon. Tavon. I'm not sure how to say your name, but thanks for the support, bro. For real, bro. We put our all into this album, you feel me? We need y'all to go in. Stream that motherfucker, share that motherfucker, buy that motherfucker. And you know, tell other people about that motherfucker and let them listen to that shit. You feel me? How I first started off rapping. See, it's so funny. Because when I was young, I didn't even want to rap like that. Like, yeah, I, you know, I knew eventually I was probably going to try it and shit like that. I knew eventually my pops, you know, he going to, you know, try to put me on the track. But I really was, you know, into making beats and stuff growing up. Like, I wasn't even really into writing rhymes or trying to get on the mic. Yeah, I wanted to. Because, you know... I wanted to do what my pops was doing, you feel me? I was young, you know, innocent, all that, you feel me? So, shit. One day, he just was like, you know. As I got older, he was just like, you know, he want to get me on the track. So, we got on the, I got on the track to... Tech Nine. That was the first track I ever got on, and I'm not gonna lie, I did not write that verse. He wrote that verse for me, cause I ain't never wrote. Like, yeah, I, I mean, I ain't gonna lie, I wrote, I wrote like raps, but it was nothing like you no know, hard, you know, devil shit type type rap. I just wrote maybe some songs I freestyled, some shit like that, just some basic shit. But I never wrote to like. One of his beats or something like that. And I never tried to, you know, write a song. So, I got on the track, Tech 9 that he uploaded that track. My name was Lil Evil at the time. Yeah, he, he wrote that for me. He did write that for me. But then, like, that click and all that, that was like, that's when I was writing my own verses. I actually sat down and for that click, I actually wrote that in like one night. I wrote that like, I wrote that quick, quick as fuck. Just hot, just, just. So I freestyling, got that bitch, wrote that motherfucker, dropped that bitch, and that bitch was hard. Because I don't, I be, I knew I could rap before I started writing, but it didn't interest me that much. Rapping didn't interest me. Like, it didn't. It wasn't entertaining to me. I wanted to be, you know, someone who makes the beats and a producer and an engineer and shit like that. So what, that's what I was mainly into as a child growing up. That's why if you go back and you look, you can find some young videos of me, some old videos of me, about like seven to nine making beats on a motherfucking motif, motherfucking chord, an MPC, all that shit. We had all that shit, man. I had all that shit growing up. 
I'm not gonna lie, I haven't made a beat and ooh, like actually sat down and tried to make a beat in part over like five to six years. My dad be making the beats, he send them to me and I write. That's really it. You know I mean? He made all the beats for the album. He do all that himself. <laughs> Gotta give it to him though. Shit, that's a lot of work. Making the beats and all that. And still gotta write. No, he do all that shit himself. Yeah, I can still drum with the pen. Shit, if I had one right now, I'll show you. All, all live shit. I might go try to find one. I can still do it. Shit. Do it. Alright, what's that? We'll see if I can find one. Sadly, we ain't got no type of pen or pencils around this motherfucker. I, mean, I can do it like just with some shit like this. Just a motherfucking lighter and a motherfucking uh, brush and just kind of get a little... Ah, oh, shit. Shit, hold up, hold up. It got of rusty. This shit kind of hard with this shit. Do it with the two. Shit, hey, ah, shit. I ain't done this shit in years. I can still do the little bit shit, but that's only with a little small ass lighter and a, and a brush. So I can't slap it down like I need to and shit like that. And I'm only on the little ass corner right here, you feel me? But shit, when I get a little pen and a pencil, I'll, I'll record myself doing that shit. Because I can, I can still hit that shit. Show my pops it the other day. I ain't as fast as I could go. But shit, I can still hit it though. <sighs> Who picks the song topics on the sum on the song? Cause It really just, see my pops, he told me it's really just, he don't make a beat knowing, like, what it's going to be about. He makes it on based on how he feels at that moment. Like, you can't be like, hey, make a trap beat. He don't make a trap beat. Can't be like, hey, make a hard devil shit type beat. You know, you can't just tell him to make a beat and he going to do that shit. He got to be feeling, you know, the vibe. And then he makes that beat, you feel me? And then the topic of the song is really just like... I mean, I'm pretty sure he, he really chooses the topics. He'd just be set. He'd be like, you know, he sent me a beat. He'd be like, write some hard shit to this or write some, you know, some shit is about some bitches. Write some shit about some bitches or that, you feel me? So I'm not sure. You mean I'm pretty sure as he's making the beat, you know, he's probably 
trying to come up with a rap or a flow or something like that in his head, so. My shit. What do you say? Shit. Do I got PS4? Uh, yeah, I got PS4. Yeah, I got PS4. Just add my gamer tag. It's Damaged Minds. All together. And then at the end of Minds, it's not an S. It's a Z. So Damaged Minds. That's my online ID. But, yeah, I mean, rapping, that's, it is fun. You know, now that I, you know, write my own shit and I know how to do that shit. It's just, I'm a teenager and I'm lazy and I be trying to be in the streets and be outside. But, you know, I need to get to the paper. I need to get, I need to get to the paper. You know what I mean? The paper going is more important. Do you make beats, man? I ain't going to say I can't because I haven't tried in a while. So I don't know if I still can <laughs> a rap battle against me and my dad it'd be a good one I feel like he gonna win he gonna win cause this nigga's punchlines are crazy as fuck but shit I try shit but it'd be that shit would be crazy Big facts. That should have been crazy. That should have been crazy. But shit. I mean. Me and Killer Elite. I don't know. That shit. I don't even know. Because Killer Elite. Killer Elite. He, he caught with it too. I ain't gonna, like, I ain't gonna hate on none of, ain't none of the clan members, cause they all cold, we all talented as fuck. I mean, we all rap different, though, see. It'd be kinda, like, I don't know, I can't really compare us to, cause we all rap different. I mean, me and my dad are probably the most, you know, we rap similar, cause I, you know, I learned his flow, cause I always heard his flow. Growing ups, that's all. That's all the music. When you was in Evil Pimp's car, bro. You was bumping Evil Pimp, bro. You was bumping that shit. Man, nigga used to have subs on that motherfucker, wanging that motherfucking Evil Pimp. For real, but shit, Killer Lee, like he talented as fuck. Shit, but you never know, shit. So it depends on what, what y'all like, who y'all think is better. Shit, maybe we, sh maybe we, sh maybe one day, shit, we're all shit. Just throw out a diss track on each other. You feel me? Just shit. Never know what could happen. But then that that's my family. You feel me? That's my family. Probably cause, shit, shit, I don't even know, <laughs> I ain't got no words for it cause I don't even know, but, I mean, I'm still gonna drop some songs after the album come, 
but I ain't gonna be like I don't know. I don't know shit. I don't know. It, they, I don't know. I never talked to him about it, so I don't know if he officially gonna put ski mask albums right out after mine or try to slip like an EP or something of me in there. Shit, I I don't know. I ain't never talk. I ain't ever talked to him about it really, cause I've been over really at my mother's crib. But you know, sometimes my ass don't even be trying to get in the studio. So he probably just trying to put, you know, ski mask shit out first. Sometimes my ass be slacking. I be slacking. I be trying to tell him, bruh. I be trying to just... Hold up, I'm 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 gonna come back to that stand man comment. But the person who said, "Do you just be listening to Evil Pimp?" No, I don't listen. To, he's not the only rapper I listen to, but I also don't listen to, you know, rappers in that generation. I'm I listen to some mainstream rappers because, you know, it's my generation, and that's all people in my generation basically listen to is that mainstream shit. So I mean, I there and there is some hard some hard songs out that some of these rappers be putting. They be putting some hard shit out. Not all they shit is bad. They they have some real hard shit too. But I be but back to Stan Man coming. I be trying to tell my pops like like get me on with Stan Man. Put me on a track with Stan Man. I be like the fans even be saying it that Stan Man and. Evil Prince Club, that shit, that should be crucial. I, I'd be like, at least just let me do a song with him. The nigga hard. Just kidding. <laughs> Give us that Evil Prince. No. You fuck with Shoreline Mafia. Nah, not real. I ain't even heard of them. I ain't even gonna lie to you. Have, I ain't even heard of them like that. I'm boofing this square. I'm chiefing that motherfucker. But yeah, shit. I just been sick, though. You feel me? Motherfuckers thought they had corona. Went and got tested. Came back negative, you feel me? But I just got like a cold and shit. That's all. Just a cold and like a strep throat. So I've been just at the crib chilling. Still smoking though. <laughs> like a dumbass, but shit. You could do a feature with anybody. If I could do a feature with anybody, who would it be? Probably like shit. Just for the clout. Just for the clout and the attention, it'd be somebody who's popping now. Just, you know, you know, for that clout and shit, you know, get more fans. You know, some people might even fuck with the music, you know. You you do a feature with somebody big, that's just going to get you more clout so you can get more fans. And that's more money, you feel me? So it'll probably be like someone that I know is going to... Be a hit like I. It have to be with someone big like that. I know that motherfucker gonna do numbers. Shit like anybody like I don't even know. Just someone I know that shit gonna do numbers like Jay Z or some or some shit like that. Something I know. Oh, shit, the hell no! I ain't doing no motherfucking. Feature with no six, die. <laughs> Niggas gonna think I fuck around with the feds. They don't think I cooperate with the feds. Hell no. Nah. Not over here, nigga. You don't talk to no police. Nothing. But shit.
And yeah, we got music videos coming too on the way. We got we got my fucking we got music videos coming. They coming soon. I'm finna meet up with my pops here soon, and we finna shoot a music video. What happened with you and the police? What happened with the police? Shit, now they was just trying to. They was just trying to violate my rights and shit like that. Like, they was just thinking a nigga's dumb and don't know his motherfucking rights, basically. That's all that that, that really went down. My brother lit off a motherfucking. We was out there really lighting off firecra fireworks, like at a park. It was a motherfucking beach and shit. And we got done. Out there on the beach, shit. We went to the motherfucking parking lot and we was letting off them big ass firework crackers. And the motherfucking DNR came, swooped around as me and my bro was lighting them bitches off. They ain't see me like them bitches. They ain't even see none of us like them bitches. Cause we lit them, they went off. DNR came around maybe like 30 seconds after and we was walking to go put some mo in there cause we was gonna light another round. But then that's when they swooped around the corner. So as we was walking up to the firework thing, we as soon as we seen them, we just turned around and we went back to the car and we like, fuck, we finna go. Shit, they ain't see us like that. They gonna have to prove we let them bitches. You feel me? So they come up. First of all, I was gonna pull off. But then he came, hopped out, put on his lights, and then my bro was standing outside the car with the, because he went and he went. And he stood outside. I don't even know why this nigga stood outside of the motherfucking driver door. The nigga didn't even hop in the car. Nigga stood outside the driver door. Motherfucking DNR hop out the motherfucking car instantly. He already was. This nigga hopped out running like, like damn nigga. This nigga really thought we was just about to take flight, flight on his ass. But shit. So he hopped out. Motherfucking. He was like, can I see some ID? Or who's lighting the firecrackers? I don't even know what the fuck he said. Cause I was in, I was in the car, nigga. I'm shit for the pull on out shit. I said shit. He he ain't see me do them bitches. He finna have to prove I did them bitches. So I'm already in the car. Got that bitch started. I'm reversing that motherfucker. As my bro, like I'm finna leave, bro. Cause bro just sent out there. I'm like nigga, we finna go, nigga. He ain't see shit. He ain't see us like them bitches. He just heard them bitches, but he ain't see us like them bitches. So then shit. I hop in the car, nigga, I get to drive it, then I run back up in his car, motherfucker, my bro still outside, now I'm driving off, and my bro still out there, so my bro just, he just run, nigga just, like, he just start running, so then, I pull up to a motherfucking stop sign, DNR pulls in right in fucking front of me, throws on his lights, then the motherfucking other DNR pulled up in front, uh, no, that, yeah, the DNR pulled up behind me, put on his lights, another DNR pulled up in front of me. So then he was like, he he gonna walk up to the car. I'm like, what? I'm like, what is you stopping me for? Why why are you following me and stuff like that? And then he's like, then he, he gonna walk up and be like, well, you're shit. What did he say? He said, fuck inter, fuck. What did he say? Interference with a motherfucking. I don't forgot what the fuck he just said. Interference with a crime scene or. Or some shit like that. Or a crime or some shit like that. And then I'm like. No, then he asked to give me his motherfucking. He asked me to give him my, him my motherfucking ID. And I'm like, what law did I break? He was like, interference with a crime scene or some shit. Like I said, just some shit like that. So then I was like. No, that was like, so am I being detained or whatnot like that? Cause I told him I'm not giving him my ID because I ain't. Bro did not get in my car. You st you stopped to talk to bro. Bro ain't get in my car. He ain't touched my car. No, like that. I got my car. I walk. I drove off. Bro ran off. I ain't interfere with shit. He ain't get in my car. He ain't touched my car. None. I ain't say bro get in. Let me, you know, drive you off and some shit. We can do a high speed chase. I ain't say none of that shit. And he was out there. He saw me get in my car, and drive off. So then they pull off to go find my bro because he's taking them on the chase. The other officer hopped out his car. 
And while the other, the DNR hopped out his car and started chasing my brother on foot. And the other motherfucking car drove off and went to go chase them. And he blocked me off. There was, there's a, going to the motherfucking beach, you have to go around the motherfucking, it ain't no real beach. It's like a lake, but it's big as fuck and it has sand on it, so we just call it a beach. But you have to go around the whole motherfucking lake, and it's a narrow ass road, like, it's narrow as fuck. And they pulled in and they blocked that road off. So when I drove, I couldn't leave the park. So I'm driving and I go down there. It's probably like they pull off. They pulled up part like a mile down too. Just to block me off. So I pull up and I'm driving. And they're like, well, this car is being detained. It's a part of an investigation. I say, what you mean? What, what, what crime did I, you know, what crime did I break in? And shit like that. And then he was like, park the car, turn it off, give me the keys and all that other shit. And I'm like, nigga, you're not finna, I'm not finna give you my keys. I'm not finna give you my ID until you tell me what law I broke. And I said, you can detain, you can arrest me if you like. But if he arrest me, I'm just going, you feel me, sue the police because he illegally detained me and arrest me, like. Come on, bro. Like, niggas just really thought I was just dumb. And he kept trying to get my ID and kept trying to get me to give him my keys to the car. I'm like, I'm not giving you shit, bro. I ain't break no laws. And I even showed him because I keep, my, I keep my, my driver's license in the back of my phone. And it's a clear case to my iPhone. So, and I even showed my flip my phone around. I said, bro, I got my license right here. But you ain't getting that shit, bro. Big facts. <laughs> He's like, come on, bro. You got it right there. Just give it to me. I said, big nose, nigga, big nose. <laughs> I was like, hell no, bro. You not getting shit, bro. Period, nigga. You was not getting shit. Exactly. They not getting shit. For real. That shit, I'm out there swimming and shit. I going back to the crib now, shit. I ain't break no laws. I ain't finna get y'all shit. Motherfuckers. But nigga, I'm not crying. Nigga, it's just, I'm sick, shit. Stuffy as hell in this motherfucking bathroom. And I'm in here hot boxing. But shit. It is, them motherfuckers really thought they was going to get down on me. Yeah, they was after me for no reason, bro. I'm just chilling, you feel me? Doing my motherfucking thizang. Kicking it with my girl at the beach and my bro and his girl, you feel me? We just at the beach chilling. Shit, don't smoke so much. Hey, I'm a pothead. I smoke all the time, all the time. Just like I got pulled over when I was like 16. Motherfuckers got pulled over. I ain't have my license at that time, so yeah, I was breaking the law then. And I ain't have my license, and they pulled my ass over. Because I look suspicious. Hey, what the fuck? I, what? Them niggas, them niggas, I swear for God, bro, they put me, they put me over because I look suspicious. Oregon programs. I'm not, I'm not even really sure. I know there's one, I, I I have it on the tip of my tongue, but I can't, I, I don't know the name of it. But I, I got one on the tip of my tongue. I just can't, I'm hot right now, I can't even think of it, bruh. I ain't even gonna lie to you. When the Crucifix album gonna drop on CD? I don't even know if we dropping it on CD, bro. You might just, we trying to, you know, get the streams up. We most likely just gonna drop it on every platform. On the media, you feel me? I don't know if we're going to do a CD. 
Might do, might do a couple, but I'm not sure if we're gonna do them. I'm, I'm gonna have to ask my pops what he trying to do. Last time I asked him, he wasn't trying to do them. But shit, we might sell some special, some special ones. Shit, you pay. Shit, we will get you a CD. <laughs> When I, like, if I drop an album or CD, I really want to be called Prince of Darkness. Just for my first, first album, first. Evil Prince. Prince of Darkness. That, that's why I want my first album to be called Prince of Darkness. That should have be fine. Boy, that should have slapped. What happened to all my father's deleted music? Shit. I don't even know. Like, I don't know why people deleted them or what happened to them, but I'm pretty sure y'all just hit us up. Like, my Facebook, it's in the description and my Instagram. Go under there and add me on the book and follow me on Instagram. Hit me up and tell me what all songs that y'all want. That I deleted and I can see if my pops will go re-upload them on his channel. So just hit me up on what songs y'all all want re-uploaded that were deleted. And we can see if we can get them uploaded for y'all. Yeah, actually Prince of the Darkness movie is real good. You doing beats too. I'm going to try to do them, but, I mean, when I, when I, when, I'm, I'm going to try, I'm going to try to make some beats, at least for when my album drop, I'm going to try to put some beats on that shit. Didn't your dad do one called that? Yeah, he did actually do an album called that. Or I could just do Prince of the Darkness Returns. As his son. You feel me? Oh, that shit will go hard. Prince of Darkness, Evil Prince, Prince of the Darkness Returns. And it's his son. You feel me? Yeah, that's what I'll do. That's actually a good idea. What was that song at the start? When we first, oh, when I first started it, uh, this live, it was I Want It All by Crucifix Clan. Go run that up. 20 something. I guess I like 21k views. Let me go look. It is at 22k views. Y'all go run that up some more. For real, for real. Hell yeah. Poochie. What, what, what Poochie is this? Do I know you? Is this our cousin Poochie? Yeah, I'm with, I'm at my mom's crib right now. I still talk to my mother, drama queen. So get you touch fire, bro. Thanks, bro. Get you touch. Cause I'm hood rich. Caked up. Money long. I got enough. To get you touched. To get you touched. Send some songs that y'all want me to play. I'll play it. Cause I got said I got one of them sub new speakers. One of them that got the subs in it, them loud ass speakers. Had one of them bitches a long time ago, but I lost that bit. Had to get another one, because them bitches loud as fuck. Yeah, he got money for music. Look what type, look what car that nigga driving, bro. Nigga driving Maseratis and shit. Nigga driving foreign cars, bro. And Ben Mercedes and shit like that. You seen all the cars that nigga had that he done fixed up if you've been following him for years and listening to the music and shit for years. He done fixed up all the motorcycles and shit and the jewelry. I actually have a feature. 
My dad, oh shit, my dad hit me up. He said I had a feature with somebody from CD6. I think it was Lord Lil Infamous. I need to actually hop on that. I just remembered. He hit me up about that. That little infamous was trying to pay me for a feature or some shit like that. Yeah, that shit, that shit would be fine. You know, I'm gonna put the feature. Yeah, I remember Lady Dead. Uh, I remember Lady Dead. I was shit when my dad was with her. I was little, like five years old, like in my fucking preschool and kindergarten and shit like that. When he was with her, so I I remember her because he was with her for a while. All of the crucifix, I think you have the most potential. I appreciate that. Shit. I'm a beat, shit. I know, yeah, I'm finna, I'm finna start hopping on that shit more though, like, get on my A-game with this shit. Make them busters draw, shake them fake TV clowns down on time. Hell yeah, that's a good ass idea. That's good shit. The favorite motherfucking, hell yeah. yeah. We appreciate that man, keep supporting. That, I've heard that song in a minute. That still run Chevy. I forgot how that go, but I can, you know, let my pops know that someone suggested that. Do we still run Chevy part two? See if we can get that off for y'all. Got enough to get you touched. You gon' run the lip and we gon' leave your body in the trunk. I'm hood rich, caked up, money long. I got enough to get you touched. My dad still be smoking. He still be, he still be getting high. He don't smoke as much as he used to, cause you know, as he got older and shit, you know, his lungs ain't as good as they used to be. But shit, he'll still be, he still be high. Shit, he still be smoking. When I be having some weed and shit, shit, me and pop was getting high in the basement. <laughs> we high, just down there bumping some evil pimp. We've been bumping the album, man. I done heard all these songs on the album maybe a thousand motherfucking times, bruh. Like a thousand times. Some of these albums we, some of these songs we dropped two years ago. You feel know I me? Mean? They just been, you know, we got, we got songs coming, bruh. We got songs coming. We got songs that we can put out there. We, you know, it just ain't the right time. We still, some of them, I ain't gonna say all of them. Are done and ready, you know. We still got some songs that are that aren't finished all the way that still need to be mixed and shit. But we do some new songs too. We might, you know, have some old songs that was gonna go on the album, but then you know, we do some new shit and we're like, oh, this harder, you feel me? Let's go ahead and put this on there, and save that other song, you know, for a different time, and we can just drop that as a single, you feel me? It's like. I know we finna do one to that motherfucking I want it all 
And then I wanna do one to the drop, bro. Be up in the motherfucking whip. You mean you be decent. I'm gonna be high as hell in the motherfucking whip just vibing to that motherfucking that that the drop boy. Y'all go listen to that bitch on motherfucking YouTube. Crucifix clan the drop out now. You feel me? But if we was in the motherfucking but yeah, we finna we, we 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 doing music videos like our music videos they not just gonna be music videos they gonna you know it gonna be a story in the music video you feel me it's not gonna be just us you know dancing teeing up I mean yeah we're gonna have some scenes probably in there like that but it's also gonna be a story you feel me what's your take on Black Lives Matter. I support it. Of course, I, I support the movement. I'm full on support with the movement. Like, I ain't out there, you feel me, doing no violent ass protest. But shit, some shit like that happened to me. Shit, you won't see my black ass up out there too, you feel me? But like I like I go to the protest, a little peaceful protest. We I went to some, you feel me? It was out there, you know, kicking it with the motherfucking, you know, the city. You feel me? It was we was out there, motherfucker. We was out there in the motherfucking front of the police, bruh. Front of the motherfucking police station, out there barbecuing, drinking. You feel me? Smoking all that shit. Like motherfuckers had their cars blocked on the motherfucking uh, like up the street. On both sides, they had their car box so no motherfucking cars could come down that shit. 12, road, they hit you, they ain't say shit to us. <laughs> we just out there, it was, it was, it was, it was fun as hell shit. I support the movement though, like, you feel me? Because we tired of that shit. Us black people, we tired of motherfucking being treated like our lives don't matter at all, you feel me? Like, and then motherfuckers be like, so black lives are the only lives that matter. All lives should matter. Yeah, all lives do matter. But not until us black lives don't matter, then no lives matter. You feel me? Black lives, you know, we, we can't say all lives matter, but then treat us like, you feel me? Like, our lives don't matter at all. Can your dad fight for your life? Yeah, nigga. Yeah. <laughs> This nigga got boxing gloves and punching bags, bruh. He'll fade your face up. I ain't even gonna speak on it. If you wanna get the ones in with him, just go talk some shit. <laughs> yeah, Y'all can link up and you can see for yourself. And yes, my dad has... My my dad is about the shit, bruh. If he say, if he, say he gonna beat you... If he say that he gonna beat your ass, if he see you out on them streets, if you talking shit, say like you 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 feel me like you over the internet or you got some business shit going on and you know there's just a nigga who running his mouth but you can't really do shit because it might fuck up what you got going on. You feel me like that? And that nigga is blowing like pissing you off and shit. And that nigga in my pop say, folks, if I see you on them streets, bruh. It's going to be that, nigga, when it don't matter how long it is, but it can be five years from now. That nigga see you on them streets, but it's that. Big facts. It is that, bro. He ain't going to let that grudge go. No matter, like, what he doing, bro. He could be fresh up out the hospital, nigga. Fresh up out the hospital, going home, and that nigga see you, bro. It's that. <laughs> it's that, bro. Hey, bro, you ever get locked up? When? Recent? No, I haven't, I haven't got locked up recent, but I don't know if I got a warrant out for my arrest because I got some shit going on, but I ain't, ain't no police talk to me yet or nothing, so. But, you know, I'm going to just be on, I'm just going to be laying low, you feel me? Because... Just in case I don't. 
You know I mean? Just in case I do. So they gonna have to catch me when they catch me on phone them. Ain't answering no door to no police. Ain't talking to no police. They just gonna have to come, slap some cuffs on me, and take me down to the police station. And I'm gonna be bond out. And then when I get my lawyer, then I'll then I'll talk to the police. Or not talk to them, but tell them or or answer. I ain't even gonna say shit. I'm gonna let my lawyer talk to him. Yeah, I know Ghost Man, bro. Yeah. I heard your dad used to box. I think I read it in an interview. Yeah, he used to box. He used to do all that shit. Man, the crazy main Austin Akers is a motherfucking MMA fighter. So I'm pretty sure that my dad used to fuck around with the gloves and shit, you feel me? But he's quick with them bitches, so shit. If some niggas on that with me, then I'll bring them pops, bruh. Cause I'm 18. So if any niggas fighting me that's 18 or older, bruh, hell yeah, I'm sliding with my pops, nigga. The fuck you talking about? Slime with my pop. It don't even matter. Like, nigga, if niggas just jumping me, bro. My pops ain't finna let that shit happen. And same with him. Ain't no one-on-ones. If we with each other, we did the fight, it ain't no one-on-ones, bro. It ain't no one-on-ones. It ain't no one-on-ones. Just keep it 100. It ain't no one-on-ones. If someone swing off my pop, bro, I'm gonna swing right back. I'm gonna swing right back. Even if he don't swing or not. It ain't no one-on-ones. Especially with my pops, it ain't no one on ones. Feel me? But shit, I'm sick, so I just be cooling. You feel me? Like. Trying to get this motherfucking album out and shit, and been staying, trying to stay on the grind. You feel me? But that I'm gonna be out soon, so shit. Y'all ain't got that much longer. That motherfucker gonna be out soon. Who do I think the worst rapper ever in Crucifix Clan was? Who do I think ever? Never really think there was no bad rapper. Never really. Never was no rapper where I was just like, uh, nah, he don't sound good on a track. Never was no rapper that I really ever thought that was bad in Crucifix. My favorite rappers, though, was my pops, of course. Shit, um, who else? Rob, motherfucking player Rob. Uh, who else? Crazy Man. I fuck... I love Crazy Man. Crazy Man and my pops is probably my two favorite rappers out, out the motherfucking, you know, original Crucifix Clan group. Um, like, them was my favorite, too. Rob, that was my third. He was right after Crazy Man and them. And then motherfucking, who else? Those are really just my favorite three. Those are the main ones that I really listen to. So I'm part of my top three. Those are the yeah. Those are mainly the ones I listen to. Some Stan man, but Crazy Main and my pops and Rob. Those are really the only three I listen to like that. But the new members, I really listen to all of our shit. I don't really have nothing with Calvin. No Kill Elite. I don't really have nothing with Kill Elite. But shit. I still be listening to this shit when he be rapping, when he got some shit with some other people, you know? but I don't really 
Got no shit like that with him. That's just me and him. Even though me and him need to get a motherfucker song together. That shit is slap. What do you think of Lord Infamous? Um Lord Infamous, he was he was telling this fuck. I'm not never never really listened to him like that, but the shit that I did listen to, I fucked with. I know my dad was a big fan of him. But you know, I and my, I ain't really know him like that. My generation, you know, I knew him. Only reason I ever heard of him really was cause, you know, my pop, you feel me? Favorite female member? Oh. Uh, really don't. I don't know who all really the members is. I know Drama Queen. Miss Logos on the Crucifix Clan album. Well, on the, the title. But I don't really I don't really listen to the female rappers like that because they don't really have that much shit. Like Drama Queen, the only song I really listen to her is probably like The Coldest. Damaged Minds and my fucking K I L L I N G. Miss Loco, I listen to Chiefin. Uh, Chiefin High, I think that's what it's called. And Without a Trace and my fucking Goons on Deck. So I mean, if I do listen to someone like that. Seed of six feature possible. Like I said earlier, I think I do have a feature with Lord Infamous that I'm supposed to be doing. I gotta ask my pops about it. I know he sent me something like that. Not Lord Infamous, but Lord Infamous. And shit, I'm finna see though. You know what I mean? I'd love to do a feature with him. Shit, so yeah, I'd do one. How old am I? I'm 19. I'm only 19 years old. Turn 20 next year. Cooling at like 2.30 in the morning, you feel me? My birthday in June, I'm a Gemini. <laughs> Crucial. But the person who said, who all did my dad write for? I'm not sure who all my dad wrote for. I said, you know, I did say he wrote my first song. You no, know, he helps me, you know, if I'm writing some shit and I'm stuck, I'll be like, hey, Pops, you know, Throw me a punchline or some shit like, or, you know, help me get unstuck from one of the word I'm stuck on or the line I'm stuck on. I'm, and, you know, he does that for everybody. Usually, you know, if we get stuck on something, we go to my pops because he's been doing that shit, you feel me? So, you know, we try to see where he can, you know, help us improve that shit, you feel me? Are you religious? Nah, I'm not religious. What's your father's B-Day? If you know, wiki and Google don't say. I ain't gonna say. I don't know if he wants me to, you know, say his information like that. I mean, his birthday in May. I'll tell you, it's in May. But 
Am I down with the Satan? No. If you mean, and if I ever sold my soul or anything like that, hell no. <laughs> But I told my pops, I said, shit, if we need that cash, I'm going to go ahead and have to sign that motherfucking paper in blood. Oh, shit. And we put the kill with partners and we open for a dope. He said, bro, you sold it. Stop lying. <laughs> Shit. Hell no, I ain't sold it yet, bro. I ain't sold it yet. That motherfucker still, I still got that motherfucker. It's up for offer, though. Shit. What game y'all clean or what game? Rolling 20s. That pirate shit, that blood shit. That so You hear that shit out the cut, then you know, you feel me? It to one home aside, I'm saying, but I haven't sold my soul. It's not always about that. I feel like that. You donated your soul, uh, Andrew? Or Drew? Let me say Drew. You, 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 you donated your soul and you don't make a door, I'm gonna say tennis, but I haven't sold my soul. It's not always about that. Yeah, I mean, you don't have to be a... You know, you don't have to sell your soul to be one, you feel me? You can be atheist and shit like that, but... You know what I mean? I feel you, bro. That's your belief, you feel me? Like... When you fucking believe in motherfucking Jesus Christ, what, you selling your soul to Jesus? No, nigga, you just believe in that shit. Mason, dude, Prince, you go so hard, I'll split your break. Your style crazy, it's really dope, don't change for nothing. Oh, I ain't even see your, your comment, Mason. My bad about that shit. That shit was only a minute ago, though. I ain't even said that, but yeah, thanks, bro, for real, that. Yeah, that split your brain. Yeah, that shit. That shit hard as fuck. I'm about to play that shit for real. That shit hard as fuck. Some of those and some shit. Yeah, I believe in paranormal shit. Like, I believe in ghosts. Like, I ain't gonna say I believe in ghosts, but I believe in, like, their spirits and shit. You feel me? Like, because I experienced that shit as a kid. I really did experience some paranormal shit. You feel me? Like, I believe in that shit. Niggas always wonder who is the crazy red nigga up under the mask. Took you in the feet, I don't like these niggas uh, up the king and I shatter the glass. Don't like that fish, so if you do fish it, then stuck with the buster with no nuts in my face. Bro, I listen to it every day. Hell yeah. Yeah, I stick with that. Nigga right out of his self. Hand in the clip, that's tempo or clap. Head start to spin like a metal go round. Big took small, don't matter at all. When the pen coming around, then y'all go down. Kick in the door like a no tongue hoop. Body in the lake, going like a canoe. Bay on the way in the hole to the sleigh, cause the big telebass, she'll shoot you too. Nine by the dust, nine niggas crush. Shirt color red, don't need a paintbrush. Ambulance called, and they y'all getting hard to the motherfucking man for a band in the run. Your school will be leaking, let me. This limit is reaping so close with your wife, don't let me catch you pick any bullets, be speaking, let's hear what they say. That shit go crazy. Hell yeah. Where you from, bro?
Come off my medicine, I need my prescription filled Before somebody get killed, leave you laying in the bloody field In Sacramento Shit, put the word out, you know, bump our shit, you feel me? Put that motherfucker, you know, see anybody who promoting some shit You know, let them, you hear our shit, you feel me? You know, help us get out there, you feel me? So y'all help us, we help y'all, you feel me? We can do tours, we can come to your motherfucking city, you feel me? All that shit. Walk by, drive by. I'm strapped with the 9mm Only here for one reason I split your brain You just stepped out of line For the very last time In the week of this time There's a world of pain Hell yeah, go smell hard On phone them Good looks, bro That, uh Yo maker, dude Good looks Or do you need No one to say you heard me No, no and I did it off for Damien, yeah. Do you click better note my name? Talk that shit, put a bullet through your brain. Fucking with the clan, get your whole wig split. Cause you know evil prince be going insane. Niggas out here straight, me bitches. Take this pump, your wig, I'm split. And now you be filled with the crucifix. Don't got killer intention. Lost some weight, so you know I'm hungry. Hate that bitch, let my name out, buddy. Fuck long, slunk your girl like I'm Subway dead. Fuck a bitch again this Monday. Call to your face, no dental. Fucking with the click, bitch, you must be mental. Up that glizzy, don't care who you can't do. Body on the flow, getting traced like a stencil. Ooh, shit. Whoa, we all from that bitch. So was that a suicide boy is this? Shit, um to me like I didn't write it in my head thinking like oh yeah I'm gonna diss the fuck out suicide boy just fuck them niggas but you know my song is Got that nine, got that nine, got that nine. That's my, no, 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 that's my, oh yeah, no, split your brain. I'm tripping, I'm tripping. Split your brain, yeah, that was a diss to Suicide Boys. Split your brain. I'm thinking of this folk, DJ Hype Man. I'm thinking of folks. I dissed him in my motherfucking song, I got that nine, it's coming out on the album, and not dropped yet. I would, I would motherfucking... Play it, but I don't got no motherfucking. I don't got it. My pops never sent me that bitch. I know he got it on his phone, but I ain't never. He never sent it to me. I should have sent that shit to me. But I dissed him in that shit. Cause that nigga a bitch. That nigga was talking good fuck shit, but then went into motherfucking. And Cock the Gage was basically a diss to DJ Hype Man. Cock the Gage was basically a diss to DJ Hype Man too. For me, that was for me, by myself. Cause the nigga tried to remix my pop shit. And then try to talk shit. So I showed that nigga how he's supposed to remix my pop shit. And I talked my shit on that motherfucker. That, uh, Tavon or Tavon Walker, I appreciate it, bro. Shout out to Maryland, you know? shout out to Baltimore. I want to go there, you feel me? I want to make it to Baltimore on tour, you feel me? Because I know that shit be busting. Yeah, I feel like Baltimore be busting. 
You like metal, bro? No, I don't really listen to metal. I ain't gonna lie, I don't really listen to it like that. I'm late in the Rari. Told my new girl that I'm sorry. I be out hunting for money. Like a young on a safari. Switch it up, bought a new Rover. Told my old driver, move over. If you ain't fucking, then suck it. Get out the car when I told her. 13 hoes, that's a dead crush. 13 pills, is a hand rush. All this yellow like a school bus. Swag so savage, just dating. That bitch is kinda eat lean. Four bitches talking about sliding. So I'm gonna hit up the team. Moving this door across the map. And I just bought up the trap. Niggas be getting finessed. Cause that dope ain't jumping back. 26 inch on my whip. 26 inch on my dick. 26 bricks on my flip. 26 inch in your chick. And I just bought a new watch. Hop on your bitch like a scotch. When I pull up in the drop, everything on me Versace. Watch your white drip and I move. Everything on me is smooth. Bitches be wanting a date, but I'm too picky to choose. Hop on your bitch like a scotch. Hop on your bitch like a scotch. That mother got slapped. You got that gauge to your face, bitch. You killed your dad on that? <laughs> I appreciate it, bro. We all did. We, we both did our shit on that. You got your favorite verse of mine? I appreciate it. Got that gauge to your face, bitch. Fuck your nine. You are a case erased from my damaged mind. This one of my favorite songs on the album. I love this fucking beat, bro. Bring it, I'm a sinner. And I love that fucking flow. I wish I could, like, I don't know. I can't, I can't get this flow. I cannot get this flow. Yeah, my Instagram in the description. This is Damaged Minds Part 2. It just dropped. We just released it. Go look it up on Crucifix Clan. Damaged Mind Part 2. No, it's not on iTunes yet. When we fully release all the songs, we're gonna put all the bitches on iTunes, Spotify, try to get them on Audio Mac, motherfucking mixers, all that shit. We're gonna try to get them on everything. Uji or a towel, cause I'm be you wet. I wanna learn this flow. This flow is like my favorite. Or my my dad's. The needle. Upside down, the family needs the sebo. The parasites. They carry your appetite. Your face, bitch, fuck your nine. You are a case and you raced from my damaged mind. I got that gauge to your face, bitch, fuck your nine. You not a case and you raced from my damaged mind. I got that gauge to your face, bitch, fuck your nine. You not a case and you raced from my damaged mind. Gauge to your face, bitch, fuck your nine. Bro, this bitch slap, bro. This bitch slap, bro. This like my favorite song around. This bitch slap, bro. This bitch, I'm going off of the way in this bitch. This bitch slap. We gonna get you. That went back on the end. Yeah, it's gonna split you. Boy, Ski Mask and his motherfucking, him and his motherfucking AK with the motherfucking knife on the end. That nigga, boy, that nigga taking it back to them old bay in that days, nigga. That nigga is. That nigga funny as hell with it. Bring me the moon to take the, the, the damn is my pet me the nine, I'll do that shit, the. And a bus. Fuck with us. Never had a chance, even some begin to blast. I ride with her the rest. Hell, like we dirty dance. Around with her, I'll take the glass until my rent. Now I don't get you. I 
in the house, I feel the fetch. Oh yeah, yeah, we got that motherfucking I Worship Devil shit part two coming soon. That shit finna be a banger. I'm on that though. I had to hop on that. That's my dad's most viewed song. Cruiser Flix clan bumping in Seattle every day. Hell yeah, bro. Keep bumping that shit. I got that cage to your face, bitch. Fuck your nine. You're not a kiss and erased from my damaged mind. Let's get Never hot. The backbone of Iowa's economy, but Teresa Greenfield supports Nancy Pelosi's death tax that punishes family farms. Am I gonna keep Washington takes enough of going when my dad dies? Hell yeah. Leave Iowa farmers alone. Hell yeah. Let me keep that shit going. I ain't gonna stop just because my my pop's going for me. But y'all don't like to think about the bad shit, you feel me? I just like to you know, I can't even imagine that, man. <laughs> Based up blunt, oh yes, I love the Buddha sack. I don't just smoke the smoke, I need it for the cataracts. Just facts, don't tax. Chop the trees like I'm swinging the axe. Relax, sit back, cause I'm smoking in hell to the max. I'm on that gun, just spaceship padding towards planet X. And I'm having a panic attack and my heart is now beating right under my chest. No rest, get dressed, hit the phone cause I need me some sex. Now the Buddha has got my damn mind in the trust head. I'm thinking about calling my ex. She press that mess, keep my head drifting into the cloud. I don't hang with them niggas named Reggie and Petty. Just hang around niggas that's loud, around the smoke. I call for a night, but don't choke. You broke. Oh no, get the hell out of the head for the dough. And that might just be rude, but the truth when it comes to the green, I can chew with that soap in my brain. I'm mistaken, can play with that hell enough. I can't remember my name at the pack. We in the whip, extra deep, hot box in the lack. And if you don't have 10 on that, get your ass in back up, bro. Up the mega blunt, let's get hot. The smoke on another one, I just might. The weed. Got me Chinese, I so tight. I call up my main squeeze, fuck all night. Up the mega blunt, let's get high. The smoke on another one, I just might. The weed got me Chinese, I so tight. I call up my main squeeze, fuck all night. Smoking be tripping so high, so high, let's get show up. And it don't hit like this, so no, I won't settle. One time you must see red, you think that you're seeing the devil. What is you thinking? You must have been tricky. You can't. I smoke a bitch. I spark up your neck. I'm sucking for blood. It's not if you can't on this shit. It's cloudy as fuck. The smoke in my lung. I cannot say no, so I sit. We're gonna get high. You're high for some days. I'm like, I'm gonna do some things. First I take it, hit right to my lips, I kiss the ganja. No one's up to feel strength in me, do the last brand like I'm starting to change it to pasta. What you think about, y'all my cold as fuck. Yeah, these songs are new, bro. I fog the living room, the fog is thick and plus it stink. Y'all my cold as fuck, bro. I smoke like trains, now I'm higher than the aeroplane. I fell deeply in love with the butt and I call her my wife and you call Mary Jane. My lungs are done, but I pound bitch I smoke in the tub. On some suicide shit when I'm taking the hit for the rifle, I'm blowing shotgun. What you doing? I'm just in the crib, boy, what up? Uh, can you send me that, your, your plug snap? What plug? Your Franklin, dude. Nigga, I thought you already had that shit. Nah, I don't. Alright. Oh, 
But yeah, y'all ma, y'all ma, y'all ma cool this fuck with it, bruh. My favorite verse by him is Pari. Robbery to a homicide. I'd rather rob. Glock on your hip is hard by him. Well, he's in it. And what else? Um, those are just my favorite. All his verses are hard, but I'm just saying my, my top favorite. Where I think he just straight went off. Someone posted our shit on the YouTube channel. They got enough views that they get him. They, oh, uh, this one of Yama's brothers or something. Oh, this like a, oh, this like a motherfucking chopped and screwed version. Show me the comments. Pause for a drug transaction. <laughs> so pause for a drug transaction. I know, right? Your dad must love birds. I don't even know. I never seen him get a bird as a pet, like a parrot or something. So shit. I don't even know. But hey, he must love the way them sound. He probably love the way they sound. You feel me? Because when birds, when they chirping and shit, that shit, like, you outside early as hell in the morning, you just chilling and shit, bar smoking a square or some, you know, a joint or a blunt or some shit. And you hear them birds chirping, bro, that shit sound good. That shit so soothing. Y'all got dogs, bro. <laughs> My dad got a dog. They got a Doberman, but nah, we ain't got We got a, my mother, my mom, she got a little cat. She just bought that. She, well, she's got it for free the other day. So, dang, what the hell? Hell yeah, 10 toes. Yeah, them bird sounds, they be sounding hard, though. They be sounding hard as fuck. I want in, all you gon' give me that. Give me that, give me that, give me Why, who, who, who out there said these whack ass people who out there? <laughs> I haven't even heard the remix of 308, Victim of the 308, but I'm gonna actually listen to that bit. Mask on my face part too, right there. Hesitate to give me some, I'll make such a murder Mask on my face. Hell yeah, hit a lick and I have the mask, nigga. I don't know if we're gonna do a part three, man. New shoes on your feet, size 10, take them off. I know I love the way my dad flowed on this bitch. He need to let me hop on this bitch. At the yearly age, how they get some cheese. Take it get my ass in, stick on who I see. 
from the age of five. Shit, I'll talk to him about that shit. About getting a victim of three. Get on this boat. I'ma catch a murder case in its cock mask on my face. This bitch go hard. I need. I need. Do need to do a remix of this bitch. Crack next. Cook on the stove like some collard greens. Rain your eyes. Yo, Jazz. Appreciate the support, man. Shout out to Germany. We appreciate it. I appreciate it, NXVX. Yeah, man, mask on my face part two, you go crazy. Yo, hold up one second. Hot or 
signs, so this place was red. For the first time, it's from a bar. Yeah, my teeth go wet, it's cold, wet, still clean. Yeah, I cook crack on the stove like some collard greens. It's love to see you hey and kind of log like your dad. I don't, I don't know what you mean. Yeah. I want to get, uh, I want to drop some classics too, you feel me? I'm going to be some classics. My first song is going to be classics by the time I get my fucking older, you feel me? Look at that motherfucking shit. I worship devil shit, bro. 1.2 mil views, nigga. Yeah, they can play all the way through. Tomorrow can only be better with Lonely's breakfast. A tomorrow that says Bay Cat, not Bay Cat. Here we do not ask. Shit, just be chilling. Yeah, yeah. Scarecrows. I'm finna show y'all some bougie ass shit. I'ma hit this bitch. Watch this. I'ma hit that motherfucking rope. That you motherfucking duck. Play not trying to date, I... He said, I'm smoking now. <laughs>
Y'all, I appreciate all the support we get right now. Appreciate it, Phil. My mom's sleep right now. Drama queen, she's sleep. Man, ending up dead. Chris, my dad pistol break through his head. Lucifer calling on my seat, red and I don't trust the soul because these niggas is fans. Bullets like Dracula, piss in your vein. Demons ain't talking, I'm going insane. You cannot hide from me, even this guy, because I got some big guns, I will shoot on your plane. Nigga, I'm looking this up in your house. Nah, she don't rap no more. Who is Lady Dead? That's one of my dad's like exes or some shit. Yeah, I love voices say to kill. Voices say to kill Wayne. Every time they come out. I will make Lucifer cringe. You must have forgot. They don't know about this. You run that lip, got caught, and I know you hate it. Swim then by that click. What's up? Heard you acted tough, so now you better not run. You run. Ain't no time to duck when Kufit got that gun. Why you say you happy for playing wrong? What up, bro? Serving the Zod, nigga. Some people do. Like who? 
I ain't nobody out there. Ain't none of the niggas that. Did you hit folks up that I sent you, nigga? Yeah, no, I, I don't that. Why? How much you trying to get? Uh, three G's. You hear me? Yeah, alright. I'm gonna see what I can do. Wait, try. Another drug interruption. <laughs> but they not out in the streets like that, bro. They not about the shits, bro. Niggas be tweaking. Like niggas ain't get shit. Like they ain't get shit. Like, nigga, would you rob me? You just hit an unnecessarily lick. No, you ain't even hit a lick. You just, I don't even know what to call it, bro. Cause they ain't get shit. They ain't do shit. Mm. Only shot him in the foot. What did you do, my nigga? Nothing. It ain't like nigga was all beat up and yeah, you like come on, bro. Niggas is bitches, folks. And they ain't gonna say who you know. Ain't nobody gonna you know. But, hey, them niggas can keep hiding and ducking. They not on shit. Yeah, exactly, bro. When we see him, it's that. Like, for real, niggas is weird, bro. Like, how you not, like, how you not get shit and it's two of y'all with a gun? And you still ain't get shit. Like, them motherfuckers should have just kept on walking, bruh. Yeah. Niggas motherfuckers should have kept on walking. <laughs> it was not they day. It was not they day. I bet they ass felt, I bet they ass was mad as hell walking back to the crib. They in there mad as hell. Regretting that shit. Looking dumb, just, just, just looking dumb, nigga. I know they felt dumb. I know they felt dumb. Hell yeah, nigga. I, I know they felt dumb, nigga. They look dumb. They look dumb. This shit sound dumb, nigga. They, they felt dumb. I bet Tory Dolls they walking back to the crib, mad as hell, blaming it on each other. Talking about, you should have did this, bro. You should have did this. Mm, dumb, nigga. Y'all are dumb, bro. You look dumb. Man. They need that. They, they just need to get out the streets, bro, before they end up dead. Oh, for real. Because they is not with the shits. At all. <laughs> For real. They, they walk back to the crib mad as hell blaming each other. <laughs> Too mad, boy. Big facts. Like, I know, like, you just know they felt dumb. You know they felt dumb. Like, when did you feel dumb? You, it's two of y'all. Y'all got a motherfucking gun. And y'all failed to rob a nigga. You know they ain't tell nobody about that. Hell no. They gonna lose all their street cred. <laughs> Niggas gonna get on their head, nigga. They ain't tell nobody about that right there. They kept that one to each other. <laughs> Tell on the corner, Randy Pennant worked for cheeseburgers. <laughs> My niggas.
12 gauge robbery capital. Niggas. Niggas is goofies, bruh. Niggas is goofies. Niggas out here snitching on their own gang members and shit like that. Niggas is weird and goofies, bruh. I mean, I ain't never. I I, I seen play raw bands like, like when I was young and shit, but I never grew up around playing Rob like that. Like I ain't never been around him like that to see if he really, you know, out here like that in the streets and gangsta life. From what my dad told me, I mean shit, seemed like he was out here enough. You feel me? But I ain't never, like, seen him, you know, get gangsta on somebody. So I'm having to go with my dad, you feel me? Because I've seen my dad this shit. I know what my dad has done. Who is your influence to start rapping outside of Memphis rap? I don't really know, to be honest with you. I don't understand that question like that. Like, I ain't sure, but shit. What the most gangster story with that shit? I don't know. <laughs> I ain't never asked him, really. What's the most gangster shit he's ever done? Hell yeah. It's hot as hell up in this bathroom. I ain't even lying. It's hot as hell up in this bed. Now, what was y'all saying? Like East Coast rap, for what to impose? Like East Coast rap or West Coast rap? I have to say, like, I'm more like of East Coast rap. Yeah, I, I feel like yeah, mostly East Coast rap. Fucking uh, trying to think, cause I got some motherfucking. Like I fuck with like, I fuck with see, main rappers I really fuck with, and like, just outside of Memphis rap in general, just like even in this generation rappers, it's like still people that's from Memphis, like. Young Dolph, you know, I fuck with his shit. And, like, motherfucking, like, Key Glock and shit like that. Like, those type of rappers, you know, they sh from Memphis, but they still be rapping about hard shit, not about all that trappy shit. It, 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 it's hard shit. But I don't really, like, none of them really influenced me like that because I don't never try to rap like none of them or, like, rap on one of their tight beats. I just really fuck with their music. The only person who really influenced me to rap is my dad because, you know, I rap just like him, and you feel me? And I'm used to his beats and shit like that.
DJ Paul and Juicy J, Juicy J. DJ Paul, trash as fuck. That nigga DJ Paul, whack. Nigga buns. Nigga, nigga to hang his music career up. For real. Cause that nigga boy. That ain't it. Yeah, I'm gonna call like what were the shotguns when you were wrong heavy Him and his little one arm ain't it, bruh. He need to go sit that shit down. There goes the Seed of Six feature. Shit. I still fuck with him. <laughs> the nigga is buns. That, that's just like. I fuck with some of his old shit. I'm just talking about his new shit in general. His new shit. Shit. Hey. It's all jokes up here. Face ass. Like. I fuck with the C the six, like little infamous and shit like that. Just I mean you can fuck with someone you can fuck with uh you can fuck with somebody like somebody in their group and I fuck with a certain person, you feel me? Even though he not I don't know if he not, yeah, he, I'm not saying he's in C six, I'm just saying like his he's his uncle but shit. I, just, I mean, that's just my honest opinion. You ask me, Juicy J or DJ Paul, I just told you my honest opinion. I don't fuck with DJ Paul. I mean, I didn't say I don't fuck with him, but I just don't fuck with his music. I don't feel it. That's my honest opinion. There ain't no hate on him. I'm just saying. I ain't no fan of his music. Ain't no hate, ain't no disrespect. We a friend and family channel over here. <laughs> Face ass. Motherfuckers just shit. I'm keeping it G Rizzle. G real with y'all. <laughs> they said this return beats. Nigga, no, not. Nah, I ain't gonna talk like that, bro. <coughs> yeah, no, not this me. Nigga, no, not this Prince of Darkness. Ah, <coughs> uh, shit. Hey, I ain't gonna lie to this anybody. I just have been them, Lil Wayne, all them motherfuckers. If I had to. And I ain't not for no reason. Just if I had to. Paul.
Paul and my dad need to collab. I don't know. See, y'all gonna have to talk to him about that. He might motherfucking, she might do it. Depends on what the benefits is of that shit, you feel me? gonna hit y'all up. Part go live again later today. Shit. I'm about to part take my ass to sleep. You like NBA, young boy. I mean, yeah, I can relate to the music. I, I mean, I relate, like, some some mainstream, like, rappers, like, I actually relate to. Like, I like, you know, some Chicago rappers, like, like, they see it. The rappers I don't like is them motherfucking trappy ass rappers. Like, I can relate to rappers like that's talking about real shit. Like, if you listen to Paul G raps and they talking about real shit, like going through the struggle shit. Like, not like you feel me? Like just talking gibberish shit, like this dumb shit. They talking about real shit, like real life struggle. If you listen to their raps, that's what they talking about. They're not like the mumble ass trappy rappers. Like, I can relate to shit like that. You feel me? They out there talk about being out in the streets, hitting licks, shit like that. Like, you know, just relatable shit. You feel me? What's my favorite horror movies? Uh, favorite horror movie probably like I'm trying to think. Favorite horror movie part dark dark skies. My part one of my favorite horror movies dark skies. Cause I'm like me I I, I love. Alien type movies, like I'm an eight, like I love alien type movies. To me, that shit, I find that shit cool as fuck. Like Skyline, like World of War, uh, shit. I think what was called World of Wars or some shit like that. That shit, that's one of my favorite movies too, horror movies, shit like that. I'm like, uh, I think aliens are just cool as fuck, like. Feel like I want to real life see an alien and shit like that. Like, I just find them motherfuckers fascinating. I, the Maya Street team. Thank for the support and shout out to Houston. No, I haven't seen Doctor Sleep yet, but. Matter of fact, I'm probably about to take my ass to sleep. But anyways, you know, I appreciate y'all tuning in and feel supporting the channel and shit and, you know, talking with a nigga, you feel me? So, I appreciate that. But I'm about to probably go ahead and lay down, go to sleep. It's late as hell, like almost four in the morning. And I get back up, part with y'all later today and shit. But yeah, y'all have a nice night and shit. And be easy.